Do you think someone has accessed your Gmail or Google account? Can't remember your password? Don't stress, we have you covered in this short video. We will go over step by step on recovering your account and changing your password. Let's get started. First start by opening up your web browser and making sure you are on Google. Next on the top right corner, click on Sign In. If you are already signed in, a logo will appear here. Enter the email address related to your account. Press Next. Under Enter Your Password, click on Forgot Password. The next section will display differently depending on how new your account is. With this email address, I get the option on my phone to simply press Yes. This is me and start the recovery process. Once Yes is pressed, I also have the Google Authenticator enabled on this account. I will quickly switch to the Authenticator app on my phone and enter this six digit code. Make sure you enter this code within the time frame on the app. If entered correctly, you will now be allowed to change your password. Make sure you make this a stronger password this time. I will quickly show some other options for account recovery. Enter your email address the same as the previous one and press forgot password. With this account, I set up a secondary email as well as entered my phone number. You can enter the code here that was sent to the other email address. If you don't have this, you can simply get a text to the phone you use when creating this account. These are the main options you can use when you are recovering your password. If you have access to your account still but you would just like to change your password, there is another option. Click on your icon and press Manage Google Account. Next on the search bar, simply type password. You will now be asked here to enter your password. Enter it in and press enter. Once the password is verified, you will be brought to the changing your password screen. You will need to enter your new password and confirm it again for the change to go through. Press change password. Don't forget to write down your password and put it in a safe place. I also like to save passwords and notes in my mobile device. Another thing to keep in mind is if you change your password, you will need to change it on all devices that use this account as you will be logged out. That's it for today's short video. If you like videos like this, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe, and turn notifications on so you don't miss another video. See you all in the next one, and thanks for watching.